Hi there, what's going on? Welcome back to another video. Today I am doing a review of Meg Squats Buff Chick protein powder. If you don't know who Meg Squats is, I'm going to link her channel in the box down below. She's just another, you know, fitness gal who likes to lift strong things. So if you don't know who she is, you should definitely check her out. She has a new supplement company, so I want to try her protein powder. And then I also got like a little PMS support thing here. So I'll report back to you on this because, you know, I still got like some time. But I'm going to try this on camera here today and I'm going to let you know if I like it or not and what I think. I'm going to be using my almond milk and I'm going to weigh it out. So if you want to know exactly what it tastes like and what I'm tasting, then you can make it the same way at home. I'm going to do, I already pre-logged 250. Wow, 248. That was pretty good. So we're gonna do that. Always dogs barking. Always dogs barking. That dog all the time. It's always the same one. All right, let's open her up. Do you think this scoop will be on the top? Probably not, that's okay. I'm gonna weigh it out anyway, so I don't really need the, the scooper. I typically am just like a chocolate protein powder gal. I like to keep it are real simple. A lot of times when I get flavored stuff, it'll end up being too sweet and I like to make my super shake. So not always do I find that flavors mix best in like my super shake. It does not, I got a little, it kind of smells like makeup. What is happening? Scoop is there. Look at that, beauty. It's a big scoop. Serving size is 30 grams. So I'm gonna weigh out 60 grams because I wanna do two scoops and then I'm gonna add a little bit of water so I have a little bit more volume. So one scoop, two scoop, 56, 60, perfect, okay. So cute, it's like a little buff chicken. All right, let's mix it up. I'm gonna try it first without the water. Let's see what it tastes like. Probably be really good with a banana. Or even peanut butter. Moment of truth. It's pretty good actually. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's a little frothy. I actually want to put some water in it too. See how many ounces is that? 10. 10 ounces right now. I just added four ounces of water. I'm gonna let the bubbles kind of settle and then I'm gonna taste it again and then I'm gonna rate it. Let's see. Let's break down the macros actually while we're waiting. So one scoop has 110 calories, one gram of fat, two grams of carbs, and 24 grams of protein. Not bad, not bad. Let's try it now. I'm also an ice person so I might put ice in it. Probably be really good with coffee. It's pretty good. It tastes like exactly what I would think it tastes like. It was definitely better with just the milk. So maybe if I mixed all of it with, with milk, it would be more um, of like a treat because it is, it's sweet, but it's not too sweet. It's pretty good. I'm gonna give it an eight out of 10. And the only reason I'm giving it an eight is because it's not my ideal flavor, like just personal preference. Like it wouldn't be like 10 out of 10, tell all your friends. I would just be like, yeah, this is good. I would recommend it to anyone who enjoys cinnamon. So if you're a cinnamon person, I bet it would be really good if you made like French toast, like protein French toast. You could probably mix this with your eggs and then dip your toast in it. That's not a bad idea. I'll have to make something like that. Or like if you enjoy making overnight oats or if you just enjoy putting it in your oatmeal, this would probably be really good in coffee too. So would definitely recommend, I forget how much it was off the top of my head. So I'll put it on the screen so you know how much it costs. Same thing with this. I'll put the cost of this on the screen as well. I got like a little discount code, which is why I decided to try it. Like I said, I'm always drinking the same stuff over and over and over. I just keep it real simple so everyone 
once in a while I like to try something new. I really like Meg Squats. I'm gonna call her Meg Squats because that's what she's known as. But I really like Meg and I wanna try her supplements, support her company, you know, all that kind of stuff. I will link her page in the comment box down below. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.